How do you make a 3D printed gun using a laser? CAD file. It's broken up into a couple different colors, blue, black, and red. Uh, we see this red here is for uh, scribing the checkering. We're going to do something a little bit different on this gun. Uh, so you can see all these shapes are nested together nice and tight so it doesn't take up very much space. You know we're only looking at maybe uh, on the actual part here. It's only like 12 inches you know by 24 inches here so one foot by two foot area, you can cut out all your pieces. Uh, we cut these in six minutes from this CAD file right here. Now what you also want to do is also print off some instructions here. Uh, all of these have numbers. You can see in the CAD file, they're all numbered. You can scribe them on here. Um, I didn't scribe these on here. I'm just going to look at the shapes and glue them in accordingly. I just don't want to have the scribe lines on the actual part. So if you print this out, like it says here, print this out on your printer here. You can see all the letter D shapes here that get glued together. Well, these are all numbered 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Uh, all these. Uh, making up some of your action shots, part of the uh, revolver handle here. So once you have the uh, instructions, or once you have the, the print here, you can follow it along pretty easy for when you start assembling this and gluing this. So it's just a matter of you know, starting with um, your big shape. Uh, and it's going to just be built up on layers here. So layer by layer. Grab some more of your pieces here. These are all going to get again glued into position here. And you can see the, the keys. You're going to put in your notched keys here. As well. And so that layer by layer you're going to build this up and we're going to put on a wood pistol handle here at the end but all these pieces again are going to get glued together making up our our actions
as you can see here on our assembly you can see the frame coming together as we glue that it's got a nice uh, hair trigger here uh, we're gonna put the cylinder obviously assembly into it and if we can see this cylinder stack here this cylinder stack each layer is going to get glued glued upon each one keep just gluing layer by layer by layer make sure that they're all straight and they're going to get keyed so they're nice and straight so you're going to have a, a totally separate cylinder assembly that will go inside the revolver here uh, when you make the barrel you know you're going to have you know probably over 50 of these small pieces that get glued together on a key that's going to make the length of your of your barrel here here is the finished 3d gun revolver uh, if you like guns in 3d I mean here's a real life checkering uh, versus versus this one which is the 3d plastic gun uh, and here is more of the printed 3d printed engraving with the checkering I don't know you can comment which which one you like better do you like the fine checkering or do you like the the rough checkering on these guns but here it is uh, finished product